you're going to set intention before we st I start the transmission meditation. And uh, I do channeling, so I will receive the energy of the goddess Isis today. And you're going to receive things. It's going to be, there's going to be words, there's going to be silence. Uh, don't try to analyze. You might not understand what I'm going to say. I might not even understand what I'm going to say. But it's all about energy. And you're going to receive the message you need to receive. It can be through your mind, it can be through vision, it can be through feeling. Whatever will be, will be. Um, let's see. If you want during the meditation, if you need to move, to go out to the toilet, to drink something, do it, just respect, of course, the other ones, not to try to disturb them. I'm gonna switch this off. And she's here today um, because it seems that many of us are going through a very challenge through very challenging times. I say that every time, but this time is like from my experience and what I see around me, the worse. <laughs> so it's like the message I received, it's like giving birth. We are giving birth right now to our true selves. And it means letting go of all beliefs, uh, letting go of dreams, of hopes, of everything, and not knowing what is left because we hung, hung on to these dreams and these projections for all our life. And now it's very sharp. There's no more negotiation possible. So consciously or not, we have to go through very tough times. And Isis um, is this time incarnated. She's a goddess, but she's more into, on earth today because she wants to give us the power of incarnation and to bring clarity into our embod embodiment. That's really... And I'm standing right now. I didn't know I would say that. So it's really, really her message. Um, of course, her theme is always to give us our power back. Um, she's a great healer. So she's going to heal what needs to be healed. Um, and she says she's, she's necessary right now because this is an amazing time of opening, yet it's very scary. Um, voila. Do you have any questions? Um. I would like to drink something. Yes, yes, of course. You can go in the kitchen behind and take some water. Yes. Meanwhile, uh, you can pick up a card. Just, uh, how do you say? Do this. Shuffle. Shuffle. <laughs> <laughs> so you can lay down. Thank you. You want to share something before? No. <laughs> <laughs> nope. <laughs> I'm, too, I'm kidding. So you can lay down. It's better if you. Yeah, because it's 45 minutes or something like that. Uh, it would be, be better to let go. But if you feel like staying like that for 30 minutes, 40 minutes, yes. So first, we're going to arrive here. Be completely present here in this moment. Feeling your breath. Observing the movement.
feeling your body lying on the floor or against a chair and feeling how heavy it is. You're going to scan your body like a laser of light starting from the top of your head and going down. On your forehead, it's like a pillar of light going down, white, clear blue, almost fluorescent blue light. And you're going to see where you have tensions with your breath, you release them. Now it goes in your eyes. Feel how heavy your eyes are. Your nose, your cheeks, your ears. It's like clearing, a clearing pillar of light descending from the universe, from the heavens readjusting your energetical field, your jaws, your tongue, your neck. Your shoulders. Your chest. your arms, your hands, your belly, your lower abdomen, your hips, your tights, your knees, your calves, muscles, your ankles, your feet, your toes, you are now completely immersed in this pillar of light, phosphorescent, clear, blue, sparkling light. I am Isis, Empress of the Light, empowering your own divinity on Earth. Feel this clearing. I give to you right now through this pillar of clear, innocent light, pure. Breathe into this light. Breathe this light in you. I am here to heal you today, to show you back your true light.
embodiment. Like an extraction of a foreign object in your self, this purification process is about extraction of all that cannot stand with a new vibration on earth in humanity. Like extracting a knife in you, it, it is painful, yet once it's taken off, it's a relief. And this pillar of light, this energy of light I'm sending to you from the universe, from many other planets, from all that I embody, will heal your wound faster than the speed of light. It's about resetting, starting from zero again, but from the highest vibration, from the highest expression of your own, own being. Feel the light and its work on you now. It's also about your activation of some parts of your DNA which need to be upgraded. It is like from a connection to internet with a wire to upgrading to Wi-Fi or to high fiber. It needs some change in the structure. Let whatever is happening in yourself right now be. Do you trust the clear water from a source? If yes, trust this light and this healing.
it is like reminding you of things you know but you forgot. Touch the being that is shown to you now. Embrace it. I have many forms. And today the form that is with you is the one from Sirius, another galaxy, another divinity, yet still me, Isis, Goddess of love, of unity, of freedom, of liberation. You have the strength to face whatever is happening to you right now. You are not the origin of your life. Life is happening with or without you. Surrender, drop any idea that you can control life. This is where pain occurs. When you want to control and grab what cannot be controlled and grabbed. But if you open to this flow of light that is here now, you will feel the trust that all is in perfect divine timing and all is for your own good. You will feel lighter. Relief from so many burdens. Feel your breath in this light shining on you now. The light is increasing now like a sunlight on parts on your body. Welcome the process, the healing, the transformation. A golden light. Let it be, and so be it.
surrender, my dear. I hold you. I love you unconditionally. Give me your burdens. Give it all. And feel my love. Arame Aritan Arame Karatan Itran Deston The earth is calling you now. It's her call now. like a magnet drawing you deep, deep down into the core of earth. Roots coming out of your body, connecting to the truth or your, of your incarnation here on earth. Arame Atan, let it be. Feel the sacredness of a connection with earth. Feel your unity with earth. while being drawn to the center of earth, you also receive my golden blessings. This is your multidimensional reality. You are light, you are earth, you are sounds, you are gold, you are you are asked during these transformating times to be even more present in each moment. To always do this movement of connecting to the purity of your essence and then to 
incarnate fully in your body, in this temple. I want you to feel this gravity and not be afraid of it. Like a very rich soil to feel how powerful this connection to the material world, to earth, is rich, powerful, divine. the richness of being powerful If you wish so, continue to receive this healing. And if you wish so, you can ask me questions. You are now surrendered, surrounded by golden light, like a sarcophage around all your body, clearing your different energetic fields. Now, Enter the gravity of your existence with grace, tenderness, purity, and innocence. <clears throat> you are now just pure gold light all your body, 
and this light is shining all around you like rays, sun rays, and is reaching all different areas of your life, this light, and beings that you wish to bless to. Let the questions be, let the mind be, let the thoughts be, and remain here now. Bless everything in your life, the good and the bad. Bless it because it is. And if it is, it is divine. What is, is divine. <coughs> Accept what is, love all that is, I am showing you now who you truly are. Thank you.
when you feel so, you can come back slowly to your presence here and now by wiggling your fingers, your toes, being aware of your breath, feeling all your body, Nothing will be lost. All that is known cannot be unknown. All that, it, that is felt cannot be unfelt. All that is seen cannot be unseen. Amen. Hello. <laughs> Tough to come back, isn't it? <laughs> you have questions? <laughs> no. Good. It's good because you had before, remember? I, I said no after you won't have. <laughs> <laughs> if you have some yes perhaps we can put some light oh no is it okay it's okay because i'm like <laughs> digestive system and I can't feel it and I'm curious why okay the answer is going to be very sharp you okay? <laughs> okay, it's Isis who's talking. She says, connect to your belly right now. 
and be true to yourself. Do you really want to heal? Again, try not to answer, but feel it. Do you really want to heal? Listen, my child. There is something you haven't seen yet in yourself. There is something you refuse to see in yourself. What I'm going to ask you is going to be difficult for you to accept and to hear. Give up on trying to heal. Surrender to the pain of never being able to heal. And feel my love in yourself right now. Accept this pain. of being the way you are now. From this acceptance, from this light of your own consciousness, accepting the worst in yourself, Miracle will happen. You don't want to heal at another level because your journey is to surrender to the atrocity of what you are feeling now. And we can all join in her pain, if you wish so. With the grace of Isis and thanking you for having chosen this path. This experience. Stay with the pain. <sighs> Accept it. You are not alone. See the grace in it. Hmm. 
Almost. <sighs> Keep opening. Hmm. You are blessed. You are beautiful courageous soul. Recognize your beauty. Don't see yourself as punished or diminished compared to others. Know that all the light beings are with you. with you in this experience and in awe at the grace, the courage, the light that you are. Continue to open, to let the light come in to this pain. If you resist, the light cannot come. If you surrender and open, then miracles can happen. Thank you. <laughs> yeah. Mm. <laughs> yeah. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Oh my gosh. Mm. Is there any more question or something you want to share? I'd like that. <laughs> Who wants to share? <laughs> oh, we can, yeah. If, so first, if there's someone else who wants to share, and if not, you can help yourself and see what Isis wanted to tell you through the card. It's so long, perhaps you can take pictures because there's some exercise to do. Yeah. And was it the connection stopped? So unfortunately, it didn't work. <laughs> no, she, I saw she wasn't there anymore at the end, and she sent me an email. I saw saying that as soon as I said, "Does the sound work?" It stopped. So it's weird. It's I, I think it's the energy of Isis. Sometimes it happens just like. <laughs> But at least I hope the video, yeah, I, yeah, I put two different, yeah. <laughs> but the sound, I'm worried about the sound, it might be like, <laughs> we'll see, live and learn. Okay. <laughs> wow. It's like that, isn't it? It's just... It was like, yeah, yeah, yeah. Perhaps you can put the light if you want to. 
Sorry? Yeah, I will put it on YouTube. Yeah, I edit it, cut the things like what I'm saying now. And uh, that's why I put this slide because the last one I put on, is, it looks, I mean, you cannot watch it. It has to be watchable uh, because I cannot separate the sound from the image. And it seems people like more with the image, whatever. But yes, it will be on YouTube. <laughs> and if you live far, you can still co connect with us via Zoom when I will manage to make it work. <laughs> it used to work in France. I would do it every week. But today... No. 